Let's get the final session underway. Going in lane eight is Andre Trusov, 21-year-old, very, very quick. Already a world champion in the 53. Jeong Wang goes for the People's Republic of China, the 33-year-old swimmer. Already a gold medalist in the 4x50 freestyle relay and a bronze in the 200 IM. Another one of the uh, all-time legends, a man participating and going back right to his days in Athens and Beijing, where he was a, a multiple medalist and gold in the 200 IMs. Nakamura Tomotaro is the favorite for the hosts. Silver medalist in 2012, he won bronze as far back as Athens as well. The 37-year-old, Eugeni Bogodaiko, the defending champion, 12-time Paralympic Games medalist and the world record holder. He is going to be tough to beat. But there is expectation that a couple of swimmers can. Young Hong qualified quicker than him. Silver at the Worlds, the 21-year-old. Bronze medalist in the SP7 category in 2016. Matthew Levy went one better in the SP7 class in Rio, in uh, London rather, as he won silver. Twice a relay gold medalist, but never a gold medalist in an individual event. And then the bronze medalist of 2016, that is the reigning world champion. He was also world champion in 2017. The 200 individual medley gold medalist at these games. Nelson Crispin goes for Colum Colombia in lane four. On the face of it, how do you see this race? Well, I think Bodaiko, the current world record holder, you know, he had a, a pretty sluggish swim this morning, but I don't think he's going to go out, go down so easily. I think the race is really going to be between Crispin Corzo, uh, Matt Levy, and, and, and Young. So world record holder and uh, reigning champion, 118.71 that he sits in claiming the gold medal five years ago, Garcia Tolson. A man who's proved that uh, he can do just about anything, including compete in triathlons competitively in Ironman. Matthew Levy, 34 years old now. How he'd love an individual gold medal, and it's going to be a very tough race to overcome the gentlemen around him. So, Chia Nakamura, Young, Crispin, Levy, Bordaiko, Garcia Tolson, Trusov. Final session on day four. The swimming competition is underway and nicely off the starters blocks for Crispin, but he doesn't have the underwater of either Trusov or Bogodaiko. And uh, this tradition dictates Jia Hong Wang is flying out as well, going in lane one. Yeah, and right now you saw Bodaiko. He got off to a great underwater start, but already you see Crispin coming up. He's right. He's taking the lead right in the middle of the pool there. And it's very important for him that he goes out early to stay ahead of Bodaiko because Bodaiko is going to be a strong finisher. So this is where it uh, might very well be won and lost. Great swim in the end, uh, considering how sluggish he was, relatively speaking, off the starters blocks and not using the underwater. But he makes the turn well and looks to come back home here in the men's 100-meter breaststroke final. Has he got enough of a lead? Has he got enough to keep Matthew Levy away from potentially pipping him? There's also a good swim from uh, Gia. Nakamura's completely faded. He looks like he's tightened up, and so too Jia. Now, as he hits the 75 meter, it's between Crispin Corzo, Matthew Levy, the Australian, and Boyd Aiko, the gold medalist of 2016. They're all coming up on Crispin now. Is he going to end up holding on? I think he just might. Matthew Levy and Boyd Aiko. Boyd Aiko is absolutely flying past. He's beaten Levy, but is he going to touch first? It is going to be the Colombian, surely. It's Boyd Aiko! At the wall. How quick was that finish? Oh, Yevgeny Bogodaiko has outtouched Crispin by six hundredths of a second to claim a gold medal and successfully defends the title. He won 13th Paralympic medal and he gets congratulated by one of the greats, the American. Garcia Tolson, how was that for a finish? I My mean, God! <laughs> I, thought, I, mean, I thought he had it with I, I a meter too. to go. And, but Bod I mean, Bodaiko, he is an, a phenomenal finisher, and we knew he was going to be strong. He's the world record holder. He was not going to go down that easily in that event.